Hi, I'm CJ Medico with Wearables Magazine and ASI TV. I'm here today with Kathleen Booth, CEO and co-owner of Quintain Marketing. Earlier today, she gave a session about creating a hard-hitting marketing plan. And really, Kathleen, that's my first question to you is, you know, why, why don't more distributors have that marketing plan in place? I think it's really a matter of uh, people being nervous. They're not sure how to create a plan, but also the time that it requires, uh, especially if you're not a one-person shop. You know, the buy-in you need to get from your staff and the investment of time that goes into creating a plan is substantial, but it's important because once it's in place, it really guides everything that you do. Okay, and uh, you know, you talked about as far as in some social media, and you talked about you know bad reviews, and actually that they're not really a bad thing, and they can actually help out distributors. So how is that? Oh, there is so much uh, evidence out there that people have more trust in companies that have some bad reviews as opposed to companies that have only good reviews. Uh, it's backed up by a lot of data. Basically, people don't trust companies that have only good reviews. They think, gosh, you're getting your friends to stack the odds and mm -hmm. post reviews that are, that are false and good. Um, whereas a company that has mixed good and bad it seems trustworthy. And, and everyone expects a company to have a bad day now and then, and so I think people are pretty forgiving about it. The key is really how you respond to bad reviews. And if you show that you're using that information and trying to do better, then you can win customers and keep them. Okay, and my, my last question, you brought up a strategy about uh, micro-targeting. So, mm -hmm. in quick summary, what, what exactly is that and how can distributors use that? I think micro-targeting is one of the most promising tactics for distributors, big or small. It's essentially just what it sounds like. It's a laser-focused marketing strategy that goes after a very particular client uh, with a very targeted promotion. And, and our industry lends itself well to micro-targeting. I gave some examples in the presentation, but you know, one of my favorites is um, the one that we use to get clients. Uh, we get a $5 Starbucks gift card and clip a little hole in the corner, put a branded TSA lock through that hole, lock it up, and send it to prospective clients with a message that says, we have the, the code to unlock mm -hmm. great sales success for you. Call us for more information. And people always call to get the code to the TSA lock for the $5 <laughs> Starbucks card. It probably costs 5 to $10 to send that out. And if you can get one client from that who spends you know, several thousand dollars with you each year, it pays for itself in no time. So it doesn't require a big investment of time or money, but it does yield very, very impressive financial results. Okay, great. Well, that's a great idea. Thank you, Kathleen. This is ASI TV.